You know, accomplishing a goal or dream you set out to do is always a wonderful feeling, right? Well, today, our Julissa Garza spent time over at the Texas State Aquarium with one of their newest team members who is living out her dream. Here at the Texas State Aquarium, there's a new member of the Marine Mammal Team, and she tells me that this is like a dream come true. I had always dreamed about working with dolphins and marine mammals, but you don't really know what it's like until the dolphin is right there sitting in front of you. And that's a very special bond that you can't really form anywhere else. Sophia Timmons knew she wanted to work with animals at a young age. My mom and I, when cleaning out for college, we found a note from third grade that it, if it asks you, what do you want to be when you're older? And I said, a princess or an animal trainer. In seventh grade, she was able to see up close and personal what she dreamed of doing. That's when it all set in. I had the opportunity to go to different SeaWorld camps throughout the summer. And while I was there, I got to see what it really took to be a trainer in this field. Part of her journey to get where she is today was attending Texas A&M University Corpus Christi and volunteering at the aquarium she now works at. And that's where I really fell in love with this facility and the focus that they have with education and conservation, especially with uh, how successful our rescue team is. And she says the best part of her job is having the opportunity to inspire others. It's the best when a kid comes up to you and says that they want to be a dolphin trainer just like you. Or this is the first time that they've ever seen a dolphin in person. Sophia says she's thankful for the inspiration from watching other trainers and her younger self for this dream. Every day I look at pictures where the first time that I've ever met a dolphin or been to an aquarium where I got that education background and the shows that I saw and the passion that I saw in those trainers, I thank them for giving me that opportunity to see those animals and hopefully I can give that to kids now. Jalissa Garza, 3 News.